I, I believe strongly, and we've heard this very much confirmed by various government officials, that it's not necessary to um, wait too long. I think there's a lot of capacity in the country. There is a lot of excellent expertise in the country, and it's certainly possible uh, to, to take the decisions that need to be, to be taken. Some of the things, some of the targets might require a little bit of additional expertise. So we're trying to provide a little bit more uh, time for those. We're still in the middle of um, discussing with the government the actual feasible time frame, but we're not looking at another five years on the danger list. I think that's likely uh, not necessary. I think the, all the, the, the potential is there to, to make that shorter. But what it is that we're really trying to do is to work with the country uh, as constructive as we can, and it has been going very constructive here, to try to find uh, a solution that works both socioeconomically and environmentally. So we have heard the NGOs, we have talked to them uh, throughout the week, but um, uh, we, we're not, we are not NGOs, so uh, we might have different opinions over different uh, components uh, when it comes to some of the, the critical points that uh, we, at, at, uh, at on the side of UNESCO, really fear are crucially important to get off the danger list. Now, in response to your second question, your first question, whether there is a positive trends, uh, the, the answer is definitely yes. Uh, we originally, when we were here, as you say, in, uh, in 2009, uh, we had, for example, also uh, at that time, um, invasive species on the list. Uh, we were at the time very concerned uh, apart from the other issues uh, about lion fish and the, and, and, and the way it was dealt with and the way it potentially had an impact on the ecosystem. Uh, and that's something that's very well taken into account and that is today something that, for example, is, is not really part of our concerns that are still remaining. So they're very positive uh, trends and very positive strides forward. Uh, also, for example, with the Integrated Coastal Zone Management Plan, which we understand are now uh, about to be approved. Um, so we see this. This is a very marked uh, progress from uh, the situation that it was in 2009.